Removing and reinstalling the swift attach loader on your Kubota tractor is a relatively easy task. Precautions regarding personal protection should be followed as described in your operator's manual. Begin by slowly driving the tractor between the loader side frames. Stop the engine and unfasten the seat belt and remove the caps. Next, connect the quick coupler and lower the lever until it stops. Now turn the safety lock button clockwise. At this point, it is important to get the quick coupler locked and to move the lever up and down to make sure the coupler is tightly locked. Make sure the mounting levers on both sides are at the low position. Fasten the seatbelt. Start the engine and run at 1800 RPM. Slowly move the loader control lever to the up position until the left and right guide bosses of the side frames touch the main frames. Slowly move the loader control lever to the dump position to lower the side frames into the main frames and engage the left and right bosses of the side frames to the bosses of the main frames. Make sure that the left and right bosses of the side frames are engaged by the bosses of the main frames. Then slowly move the loader control lever to the dump position until the bucket tilts down 20 degrees or so to the ground. Make sure the tips of the stands are off the ground. Then slowly move the loader control lever to the down position to lift the front wheel slightly with the loader until the mount hooks are completely mounted on the main frames. Make sure the hooks at both sides are properly mounted to the main frame. Slowly move the loader control lever to the up position until the cutting edge of the bucket comes up slightly off the ground. Then make sure the right and left mounting levers cannot be activated. Raise the boom until the bucket fulcrum pin is the same height as the boom fulcrum pin. Make sure the stand lever is at its low position. Slowly dump the bucket until the stand touches the boom. Slide the stand lever in the upward direction. Then slide it to the left side completely and hold the stand by the stand hooks. Do not force the stand lever if it gets twisted halfway and fails to stow away properly in the stand. If this happens, lower the stand lever and move the bucket to the full scoop position. You have now reinstalled the Swift Hatch loader. That's all there is to it. Thanks for watching. Kubota, together we do more.